On Sunday, December 2nd, 2007, the nation's tallest Sitka spruce tree was discovered cracked in half and blown over in a storm. For more than seven centuries, it had grown here in Oregon, towering over what is now Cloochie Creek State Park in Clatsop County. It topped out at over 200 feet and was rivaled only by the world's second tallest Sitka spruce in Washington. Now our neighbors to the north can claim that title. It's real funny how that worked out. Wouldn't you say, Washington? <laughs> you know, there's a story going around about old Cloochie. That's what we call him. It says Cloochie's splintered remains were discovered on the south side of his stump like the wind was suddenly blowing from the north. <laughs> it's weird, isn't it weird? <laughs> it might not have been an accident after all. But who would have something to gain by bumping off beloved old Cloochie? A eh, Washington? Just admit it. Admit it, you blew Cloochie away. You had the motive, jealousy, the opportunity, a convenient storm, and the means, that bastard north wind. They say that when Cloochie was blown over, the air smelled like apples. <laughs> and sales tax. Well, two can play that game, neighbor. Keep your eyes on the Portland skyline. We're building a space needle of our very own. Yeah, it's right. And you know what? It doesn't have to be taller or pointier or spacier than yours. It just needs to be here. When yours gets crushed by a meteorite. Oh, hey, didn't there used to be a big old meteorite on that hilltop by McMinnville? Hmm, I don't recall. What happened to that? Well, how's it feel, bitches? You shouldn't have messed with Gucci. No, no, no. You think you're all bad? You think you're all bad because you have pro baseball and you can pump your own gas? You ain't bad! You ain't nothing! That was Sean McGrath.